now, Fleecy. Yeah, yeah. Daft bugger still thinks you haven't seen him. He's off his chum. Shh. It's me, Horace. Don't you know me? This is camouflage. I put it on my cap over at Bite Wall. Good, ain't it? You mean to say you've come all the way around this field just now without us seeing you? Yes. Crikey! Good, eh? What are you doing up here then, Horace? Walking. Come looking for animals. Hunting? No, I wouldn't hurt anything. No, I come to watch them, learn about them. I look at flowers and all and birds, find nests. Sometimes there's eggs in them. And then I keep coming to watch chicks when they hatch. You don't touch them like, just watch them with the beaks wide open, always wanting food. Then you come one day and they've flown away, learned to fly and gone. Don't you collect eggs? No. Wouldn't be any birds if we took their eggs. Take eggs off your ends, don't you? No, that's different. They lay every day sometimes. It's got to be sometimes while you're nicking them and flogging them outside. Yeah. Pardon? You know, it's nicking eggs to sell and telling your mum they're not laying. Don't. You bloody do. Everybody knows. Just a rumour. We all know about you, Oris. Well, what are you doing up here? Sitting on this camel. Pardon? What do you think we're doing? Uh, camping. See, he's not as daft as folk make out. Are you, Alice? No, he's not. No. I say, they're potatoes, aren't they? Possibly. Smell nice. Look good, don't they? Yeah, they do. Yes. Are you scouts? You are! Scouts? Scouts are bloody not. No. I mean, camping in this fire, that's what scouts do, isn't it? All us out in countryside, camping and everything. Gangs of... Crikey, I'd join if I could. You! Yes, c'est bon. Get a uniform, be great. Why don't you, then? Don't know. It's cos you're too old, isn't it, Alice? Yes. Yes, of course. Too old to wear short trousers. It's not because you're daft, is it? Pardon? Not too deaf for the scouts, are you, Horace? No. Too old. Too old to play with lads. Do you want to play with those? Yes. Shall we let him? Mm, I don't know about that. I say, can I have a look in your tent? I was in a circus tent once. Mum took us, massive it was, with all rows of seats piled right up. And animal Crikey, I've seen elephants and horses and dogs <laughs> and, and lions and and seals even, all doing tricks. Yes, smashing it, circus. Mum took his. Say it's a good tent, isn't it? I bet it doesn't let rain in. Hey! Where are your beds? What beds? For camping. What you sleep on? We only live down there in the valley, don't we? You've just walked up. Yes, but you're camping. We come up for the day. And then go back home. There's beds down there, Horace. Yes, but not like Crikey. If I had a tent, I'd always be sleeping in it. Your man won't let you. Would. Wouldn't. Would. Wouldn't. Would. Would. Wouldn't. <laughs> Pardon? Got any water on you, Horace? Water? No. Do you want some? I haven't got any of you. No. Let's search for some. Up here? Yes, a stream. What, with bloody sheep all over? They won't hurt you. They pee all over, pee in the water. What for? They can't make it to bog. <laughs> oh. Yes, joke. Good joke, eh? What again, then, Horace? What at? Well, you want one, don't you? Why can we play with him? Can't buy some Indians, eh, Horace? Smashing. I've got a smashing horse. Can I be sheriff? You can be the Indians. 
Who else? We're the Curl Boys. Four on to one? It's not fair. You're the best Indian, the way you come across field. That's what Indians are good at. We're all David Crockett's, eh, Flutie? No, we're ranchers. Yeah, proper cowboys. Can this be my wigwam? No, that's the ranch house. Oh. What's happened, Odyssey? you see? You're an Indian brave, and you've raided the ranch while we were up in the hills rounding up cattle. And when we get back, you've already gone, and we discover you've killed our cows. Didn't. And the sheep. Didn't. Did. We saw you. Caught you eating it, didn't we? I wouldn't eat a cow. Eat steak, don't you? Pardon? Sausages, liver and all that. Yes, but I wouldn't eat a cow. That is a cow, you daft bugger. Well, I wouldn't kill one. Well, you are. That's what Indians are for. It's only a game. You've got a way to take wood up there, so we have to follow your tracks. Me on my own? Don't you want to play? Yes. Don't have to. Can get off home. No. I want to be a brave on my own. We'll give you a start, then follow your tracks. Bet you don't find us. Bet we do. What happens if you do? You have to be punished. Don't you watch telly? Punished? We burn down your wigwam and totem pole. Can't. Can? I haven't got one, see? You'll have to be tied up. No, I'm not playing. You said you wanted to just now. Yes, but not tying up. Get off there. Nobody invited you. Clear off and we'll play on our own. I'll be bloody Indian. I'm not scared. I'm not. These spuds are ready. I'll play definite. When you finish your spuds. <laughs> Smell smashing. Don't they? I bet they taste good, eh? Of course they do. Put some more on Badger. Right. One for him. Are you playing? Yes, definite. That one's yours, Len. Crikey, thanks. Smashy. Have it after. Yes. Smashing tent. Great. I might save up for one. Go camping and watch animals. What animals? I know a lot about wildlife, and I'm saving up for a tortoise. That's not an animal. It is. It's got a shell all hard, can tuck its head under when it's in danger. That's nothing. You don't know anything. I do. I know a lot. And I'm going to be working on a farm when I can get a job. Tell us what you know, Ben. Well... See? Well, I've seen hedgehogs. Anybody else get squashed all over the road dead flat? Yeah, rubbish. They're not. Gypsies eat them. What do you know about gypsies? I'd be one. If Mum and let us, and if I could join. Live in a caravan and travel. Look after the horses, learn to make pegs go everywhere. They're dirty, I'll that's it, sir. They're not. They wash in streams and rivers, live out in the open, the man told us. What man? Nobody. Private. Yeah, see? Well, you're making it up. That's a skylark. Where? Listen, you can't see it yet, but you can tell by its singing. That's a sparrow. It's a skylark, a man told us. Told us all about insects and worms and wild animals. I've seen a dead fox. It's bloody barmy. Ought to get back to his mum. No, it's all right. She knows I'm up here. I told her I was coming for a walk. Our mum says you shouldn't be allowed out. Yeah, we'll cop it if we can't play with him. Yeah, you loopy, Horace. Not doing anything. Just want to play. Ready, then? Bloody up, these spuds. Right, Horace, war paint. Pardon? An Indian's got to have war paint. Yes. Have you got some? Kneel down. We'll have to make do. <laughs> <laughs> you look right, Looney. <laughs> <laughs> there, that's better. Oh, you look a right Indian now. Do I? Yeah, right little Indian. Great. We'll give you five minutes start that way through wood. What happens if you don't catch us? Of course we'll catch you. I bet you don't. I'm a good hider. 
at five minutes starting from now. Right. Toodle up. What are we playing with this stuff so far anyway? Best than sitting here. Spread out that way. You can't go far. If anybody finds anything, give us a whistle. Look here. Ooh! See what I found? It's dead. A dead bird? Yes. So what? Well, it's dead. So what? I found it. Let's see it, Alice. Get him! Oh, oh, hey, what are you doing? You captured. No, I'm not. You are what you call this? No, I was up that tree, and you went by without seeing us. You didn't capture us. I shouted when I found that... Hey, where's that bird? We're taking you back to the ramp. No, get off. I mean, I want to see that bird. You're captured! No! <laughs> Where is it? I've got to find it. I've got to bury it. Then you can capture me. Right. I'm captured. Right. Taking you back to ranch. Right. Is that it, then? How can you follow tracks up a tree? To get rope, you have to be tied up. Pardon? Now you're captured. I'm not playing. We've been through all that. I'm not being tied up. It's only a game, Loopy. I don't like it. Let's play somewhere else. Oh, get off home to your mum. It's bloody useless. No, look, tell you what. I'll give you a joke. One of my best, if you let us play. <sighs> They're absolute rubbish. Seem better on telly. Here. This dog muck. You could have some laughs with this. See? Don't smell. Get off, Forrest. Don't you want it? Barry. Can I have my sponge? Told you to go after your mum, didn't we? Here. 
Here. Tie us up, then. I'll play. No morning. No, I'll play. Just make sure you do or there's no spud for you. Have the spud after, eh? Oh, that hurts me. Not so tight. Got to. You shouldn't be so bloody strong. Touch makes you struggle a lot. Pardon? Make you confess. It's only a game, isn't it? We might have to hang you upside down from a tree and light a fire under you. Yeah, remember the photo? They do that to blackies. I'm not a blackie. I'm an Indian. They don't seem to us. No, don't. Don't start that again. Hey, hey, don't! <laughs> Got to be punished. Killing cows and sheep, eh? That's a serious crime on the prairie. Yeah. Could be hanged. You're only an Indian, aren't you? Please, you pretend it. Might have to brand you with fire plaques. <laughs> Take fire. <laughs> Hold him. Listen, damn it, Fleecy. I shall tell. You won't get out of here alive, Blackfoot. Feel that. I'm telling. No struggling or it'll be the worst for you. Let me go. Look, he's frightened. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Just look what you've done. Just wait till my dad sees that. the Indian and they captured me. Whatever's your mother going to say? Now, have you seen yourself? was an accident. They shouldn't have tied me up and tortured me. Tortured? Oh. It's only a game. I don't want to get them into trouble. Well, you'll be in trouble. Oh, I don't know how your mam sticks it. Yes, well, she saw us out back. And I, do you think I could get cleaned up here, Mrs. Diddy? Then Mam won't shout at us. You get yourself home and get cleaned up. Horace! Horace! Ooh! Horace, hey! Come out of there, you can't go in there. It's private. You haven't seen Horace, have you, Mrs. Diddy? No, of course you haven't. Well, if he does come monding in here, send him packing, will you? Uh, what's that, Mickey Fuck? God knows what he's done. He'll be police next. He'll end up back in hospital, sure as eggs is eggs. Well, I... Uh... I'm on going to see him. Come out. Come out of there. Has she gone? Do you hear me, Harry? Mrs. Tinney. Now, you heard. Get yourself out. That's it. Now, you'll be a good lad. And I'll say nothing to anyone about you coming in here. Hey? Eh? Read Bible to you tomorrow. 